it's a step in the right direction. Uh, it shows that the whole process and trial was actually flawed. And this is a situation that we maintained from the beginning. And we demand that all the charges should be dropped and our journalists should be released now. That's including the people who were sentenced in absentia. There are seven of Al Jazeera journalists who were sentenced to 10 years in absentia, besides uh, Bahir Muhammad, Muhammad Fahmi, and Peter Gristi, who spent one year in prison until now. There is nothing that will justify imprisoning a journalist for doing his job accurately and fairly. How hopeful are you that there will be a, a quicker end to this than seemed possible just recently? If justice is followed as it should be, they should be released immediately, in fact, uh, and in the very near future. How much of this is down to politics, down to the relationship between Cairo and Qatar, of course, which has been warmer of late than certainly a year, two years ago. Do you think that is behind what seems to be progress in this case for you? As a media organization and as journalists, we don't think about politics between countries in this case. We think about our work and how we do it. And we do it, as we mentioned in our uh, code of ethics, we, we, we do our journalism in an accurate way, fair way and balanced way. And this is what happened with our journalists who were accused and imprisoned uh, unjustly in Egypt.